So we're going to look at merging scans and why would you want to merge scans? Well, quite often it's easier to scan a, uh, an object in two parts. For instance, on a, a targeted tabletop, turn it over, do another scan, and you have overlapping material between the two that you can merge. So that's one reason. There are multiple reasons. You can merge more than three two scans to make an object. You can do merging in two places in Peel. Um, you can do it at the scan level or you can do it at the mesh level. So we're going to look at the ways you can do it at the scan level. There is a slight advantage in, in merging at the scan level. It's more accurate and you retain the original data. So if we look at scan the scan 1 and the scan 2, we have targets in common because um, we have overlap and we can choose merge scan and the first method is merge by targets it is the most accurate method the other method is merge by surface best fit so we'll look at the targets first and we just define the two scans and then we say we want to keep the original scan that's a good idea so that you can always go back and try again if you mess it up and then it tells us that we've got 15 16 targets in total and if we look we've got about uh, four seven targets in common maybe yeah seven so if we put 10 as the minimum targets it's going to fail because it couldn't find 10 so we should reset it to seven and then the alignment is instantaneous automatic and very very accurate so that is the best way to merge by targets you accept it and you will see a third scan has been added to your list, which which is your combined merged scan. So if you turn off scan one and scan two, scan three is your merge. So that is the result of merge by targets. What we're gonna do now is reactivate our original scan one and scan two and perform a merge by surface so you just go to merge scans but choose the second icon and select the two scans that you want to merge scan free was our original merge so we don't choose that choose keep the original and there are three modes automatic you can try and if it's got enough unambiguity it can automatically mesh them and it's done a very good job here but if you have a very symmetrical object sometimes it can get confused so we'll show you the manual method the manual method you identify pairs of points that are roughly in the same position so align your two scans so that they represent in space where they were originally and then pick pairs of points approximate it doesn't have to be very very accurate and as far apart as possible that enables the algorithm to pre-align itself. And it's showing you on the screen on the left what it thinks is gonna be the result. So if you pick enough pairs of points and it requires a minimum of three, but you can pick as many as you want, you can, you can see now that it's got a very good approach. And then you just say best fit and you've guided the algorithm and it gets to its best fit immediately afterwards. If you're happy with that, choose merge and again it creates we'll turn off the original ones and it creates now a fourth one which is your merged by mesh surface